Hey guys, if you're getting the error message application hang detected in Fortnite, then keep watching as I'm going to show you exactly how to fix this. So the first thing you want to do is just head over to your start menu and search for settings. And then we're going to click on the settings window. From the left hand side, select Windows Update and then press this check for updates button. If you do find any updates here, then make sure to install these to the latest version. Now, the next thing we're going to do is just head over to the Epic Games launcher and then click on library from the left hand side. Scroll down until you see the Fortnite game and we need to click on these three horizontal dots and from here select manage. Then next to verify files click on this verify button and you'll just need to wait a few seconds while that goes ahead and verifies all of your game files. Once that's finished you can try launching up the game to check if that solved your issue. Now if that's not working the next thing we'll need to do is head back over to the start menu. Once again head over to settings click on system from the left hand side select display scroll all the way down and click on graphics and now we're going to scroll down this list and from here you need to locate the Fortnite game. Now if you don't have the Fortnite game in this list then what you'll need to do is head over to the top here and click on browse, scroll down and click on program files, double click on the Epic Games folder, click on Fortnite, double click on the Fortnite game, click on binaries, win64 and then you need to double click on the Fortnite launcher.exe. Once you have Fortnite added to this list click on options and make sure high performance mode is selected and press save. Now the last thing we're going to do is head back over to the start menu and search for run and click on the run icon. In the search box type in percentage sign local app data percentage sign and hit enter. From this folder scroll all the way down until you see Fortnite game and double click this. Double click on saved and once you found this config folder we're just going to right click on it and select the trash icon to delete it. Now don't worry about deleting this folder as it's going to be regenerated when we launch up our game. So once you've done this head back over to Fortnite and we can now check to see if that solved our issue. If it's still not working, the final thing I'd recommend doing is updating your graphic drivers. So for example, if you have an Nvidia graphics card like myself, then you can head over to Google and type in Nvidia app, click on this top search result here, and you'll need to download the official Nvidia app. Once you've downloaded this, you can simply launch it up on your computer and from the application, you'll be able to automatically install the latest graphic drivers. And it's really as simple as that, guys. If you did find this video helpful, then let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one.